All right, guys, how's it going? It is Tuesday, the 15th of May, 2018, and you're watching CopTalk.tv. All right. So, Emery Chan, right, he hasn't made Germany's World Cup squad. What do you think about that? He said, mate, right, I've got to be honest, right, and I know this is rotten, and I know this is cruel, and I know you're going to think I'm a bigger cunt than I usually am, right, but there's a little, little just a teeny little bit of me that's like... <laughs> Do you know what? And I'll tell you why. I know, I know, I know it's a bit rotten. I know it is. I know it is. And you know what I mean? But you don't want to play for Liverpool anymore. So why, what do I care about him? Because when that, when, by the time that tournament comes round, we all expect him to be playing for Juventus or someone else, don't we? So what does it matter? Do you know what I mean? It's wrong, isn't it, for me to take glee in his omission. I get that. All I want is one person in the video comments to go, look at me, I'm getting all Donald Trump and that. China, China, Ch oh, pussy, grab it, oh, oh, no, no thanks, um, we just, we just need, what I just need, I just need one person in the, in the comment section to go, no, don't, I totally understand where you're coming from, fuck him, and that'll make my day, I'll be happy enough, yeah, that's all right, I don't care if I'm in the minority, I usually am, uh, but no, I mean, he hasn't made the, uh, the squad, for uh, for the uh, Germany's World Cup, and um, which is a bit of a surprise, I think. I mean, I know he's been a bit injured and that, but he, you know, he's been saying he was well, he was trying to make the Champions League final, wasn't he? Uh, but they were saying that that test he had the other week was a bit inconclusive. It's all got a bit of an itch going on. Oh, you know, he's, I did a thing on here recently saying, "What about the glasses?" Do you remember? Well, I've ordered two more pair of these now, exactly the same as these. These ones got two by the dog, my puppy. Yeah. They got chewed by the puppy, which you can just see in the corner. You see two little marks. That's the fucking dog's teeth. That's not, that is not part of the design. There, That's marks from the fucking dog. And I only had them a couple of days. 250 euros, man. Seriously. For like, well, I'll tell you why. Like, I don't, look, I just don't even think it got ripped off. 99 euros, uh, no, 199 euros, I think, for one pair. Then you got to pay, for, well, you don't have to pay. Then I paid for the, like, the reflection and all that and the ultra clear lens. Do you know what I mean? And then you get a second pair free, but you got to pay the extra bits, the other 49 euros. in 249 euros, and the dog chewed the fucking things. Anyway, I said to him, I said, if you can do me the same deal, I'll have another two pairs because my people's on the tubes. Right, you, that's YouTube, yeah, you got that, didn't you? Because the people on the tubes, they said these ones suit me better than the other ones. You know what I'm saying? Do you remember when you did that one, two, one, two, one, two? Oh, one, two, one. don't even get me talking about the fucking microphone. I don't care if it's too loud, if it's too tinny or whatever, it is fucking staying. All right, it's as simple as that. And I think it looks pretty cool down there, yeah? Yeah. So, anyway, I'll get some new glasses soon. More money than sense. I mean, I could struggle on with these, you know. I've, I've, I've still got the other ones, guys. Look, here, look, look. I've still got the other ones here. Look, look. These ones. But these are these these ones are different, look. Can you see? Yeah? Yeah. I just use them for when I'm putting football on now. It, listen, do you know what I mean? I've got a 12-foot wide projector in my lounge and I still put fucking glasses on. I want to ask some of you people that wear glasses a question. And I'm being deadly serious now, right? Before I had to wear these, I didn't think there was anything wrong with my eyes. I just thought, oh, my eyes are just a bit, you know, like wet or something, you know, wet, right, your eyes wet, anyway, a bit watery, you know, I was like, oh, I can, I can read that, it's no problem, you know, in a distance, like stuff up front and that, that, you're right in front of me, I'm fine. But then she said, no, no, you really need, you know, you, you need your, your glasses and you can see clearer. So I put them on and everything is clear on the, on the you know, when it says Sky Sports in top left corner, or top right corner, whatever the fuck it is, top right and then top left, or if you're on Sky Sports News and all that text, it's crystal clear when I put these glasses on, right? But when I take them off and look around, man, I'm fucking blind. Since I've started wearing glasses, my eyesight's got worse. What's that about? Is that normal or what? Can you help me out with that, please? I've got some genuine concerns. <sighs> what was this video about Emre Chan? Does anyone else give a fuck about Emre Chan not making the World Cup? Or am I just being petty? Should I be, like, you know... Should I be one of them typical lefty LFC snowflake supporters, right? Should I be one of them that says, no, he played for us and he gave his all to us and everything. It would be pretty mean for you to, do you know what I mean? Should I be like that, guys? Or should we just go, fuck him? Do you know what I mean? Now, if he was still a Liverpool player, you know what I mean? I'd be going mental. But he's not, is he? Well, he might not be. We don't know what's going to happen. 
But there you go. Hey, talking of snowflakes, they've brought a new word out now for the opposite to them called gammon. Have you seen me known that? I can't think of anything better. If someone starts calling me gammon face, I'll be fucking buzzing. Eh? Yeah, I read an article yesterday. It said, if you're seeing gammon on your timeline all the time, this is why. I thought, I ain't seeing no fucking gammon. But because it was a big piece of gammon on the news article, it looked pretty nice. I thought, I'll have a read of that. It was on the BBC website, if you don't believe me. And it says, has your timeline been flooded with gammon? I was like, no, it fucking hasn't. How do I start at that? And apparently, it's making reference out of people's, like, gammon-coloured faces that are pro-Brexit and stuff like that. Well, I'm not, you see. I'm not into that pro-Brexit shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm quite happy with England paying for all our fancy roundabouts and stuff like that that I've got here. Do you know what I mean? And subsidising my lifestyle. So, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm very, like... Pro-European me, because it suits me, do you know what I'm saying? Cause I, but seriously, if you live in England, it's a bit of a shitter, isn't it? Because you can't get to see your doctors and all that. Yeah, yeah, I get that, guys. But apparently, the word gammon is now being used for the anti-snowflake, the opposites of them sort of thing. You know what I mean? Which I think is a bit racialist, because it's talking about what someone might look like. You know what I mean? It's not very nice, is it? But I've, you know, I've been called worse things than gammon. I've never been, I haven't been called gammon yet, but I'm quite down with it. I usually get fat cunt, something like that. No, I've got no fucking idea why. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, I'm very hyper today. Can you tell? Mmm. I'm in a good mood. Yes, I'm in a good mood. And I've just seen a notification come up on YouTube there, that new from the Tony James Show. Look him up on YouTube, Tony James Show. He does decent videos, that lad. He's a good vlogger. Seriously, he does. Right, I'm off. Does this qualify enough to be considered a, a topic for uh, for discussion, Emre Chan? Or is the video been about more other things, so I can't call it Emre Chan? Look, I want to know what you think about Emre Chan's admission from Germany's World Cup squad, right? Are you shocked? Do you care? Am I being petty by going... <laughs> Or should I have gone, that's not very nice, that is give his all for Liverpool. You know what I'm saying, guys? Let me know what you think. Right, I'm just going to find the stop button. All right, let's see what's going on. I'll see you in a bit. All right.